you guys think you take Ubers? We've got a lot of Uber riders in here. Who's sitting in the front seat? Anybody here some front seaters? Nobody wants to admit it. That's how I use that when I find a creed. Oh, we got a creed back here. Right there. Yeah. This guy sat in the front seat in Santa Barbara, California. And uh, I didn't think anything of it. I was like, oh, that's not too big of a red flag. That's fine. He's in the front seat, sir. Uh, I should have seen it coming. Conversation took a weird turn. Uh, he's like, so what are you into? And I'm just like, well, I like music. I'm a musician. And he was like, oh, yeah? Does it make you hard? <laughs> And I'm like, huh? And before I knew what was happening, my Uber passenger grabbed my wiener, everybody. True story. Yeah. Yeah, it got weird. And uh, the guy that looks like me, you probably would have think, you know, I'd probably just hammer smash his face or something. No. I kept driving. I made it to like a weird, awkward date. I was like, bro, what are you doing, man? Uh, has this worked before? Was I supposed to pull over? And we just going to start blowing each other. Um, <laughs> But no, his response was, I, I'm sorry, I had a bad day. Uh, I've had a lot of bad days. Never once did I feel like grabbing a stranger's crotch was going to make me feel better about it. Uh, my, my joke is not a stress ball, so uh, Yeah. So, I was going I reported him immediately. He got banned from Uber for life, and he's probably out there whacking off the drivers somewhere. Uh, I'm gonna go sign up for Lyft. All right, thank you. I'm Noah Sharp.